Sheldon friends, welcome to Doff Reactions and Nazir 66. So far, the Talmud Olympics includes a few different sports. The Levite lift and twirl, the Rabbi Tarfon sack race, Carmelite parkour, and by far and away the most difficult of all, the Yavam high dive. On this last page of Tractate Nazir, we get a new sport to add to the lineup. Competitive blessings. Rav and Rav Huna both told their sons to leap to do the blessing after the meal with alacrity. Saying amen, that's for other people's sons who aren't athletically gifted. The Gemara asks, didn't Rabbi Yossi say in a Baraita that the person who says amen is greater than the person who actually says the blessing? And didn't Rabbi Nehorai give the analogy that the people who say the blessings are actually like the foot soldiers who go into battle first and then get squished? And only then do you bring out like your Judah Maccabee or equivalent on a war elephant? Those are your people who say amen? People who say amen are obviously more badass, they're cooler, and they get elephants. Then the Gemara says, well, on the other hand, okay, everyone gets a participation trophy elephant. Both the person who did the blessing and those who said amen. But yeah, according to this other Baraita, the one advancing to the next round, to the semifinals, is the one who hustles the fastest to say that bracha. So I guess this means we all need to start waking up super early to train every single day at the Big Talmud gym. Run drills for grabbing the Kiddush cup super fast and then it becomes muscle memory. <sighs> Practice swimming underwater and holding your breath for a long period of time so you can recite a whole bracha without taking a breath. And maybe like do some push-ups so we're strong enough to elbow away the competition. No, I'm lighting this menorah, bitch. Actually, wait, no, don't, don't do that one. We don't want to have our brachot disqualified on a technicality and get ourselves barred from the competition in future. And with that, I just want to say mazel tov to everybody who is finishing this tractate today. Onwards we go to the next round, which is tractate sota. We're in the big leagues now. I've been training since Yevamot. Am I ready? I don't know. There's only one way to find out. Hadranalach. I'll see you there.